last 10 years and uh, we can actually see how much wellness and happiness yoga has brought to the world. Just like the Prime Minister said, it's often a, a talking point, a conversation issue. It's something which people share. It's really a day which many of us look forward to uh, and I'm very, very happy that I could be here uh, today uh, with so many uh, members of the diplomatic corps. I think we all saw uh, the Prime Minister in Srinagar. Uh, as always, uh, he's been an inspiration for uh, developing yoga enthusiasm and awareness across the world. Uh, and today, uh, here we were, uh, where I was very happy to see so many diplomats, ambassadors, uh, colleagues from uh, the foreign ministry uh, join us uh, uh, at the yoga session. It's, it's really, I remember, you know, 10 years ago uh, when uh, the idea came of uh, moving a resolution in the UN. So we've, we've come a long way, I think, in the last 10 years. And uh, we can actually see how much wellness and happiness yoga has brought to the world. Sir, how it has impacted in building the international relationships as well? You know, it's, it's been a great bonding point uh, that are different from different cultures because it's actually become universal. Uh, and uh, uh, I find often when you go to meetings, you meet, uh, you encounter people from other countries, just like the Prime Minister said, it's often a, a talking point, a conversation issue. It's something which people share. Uh, and there's a certain uh, joy of uh, sharing that. So it's, it's really a day which many of us look forward to. Uh, and I'm very, very happy that I could be here uh, today uh, with so many uh, members of the diplomatic corps uh, for the occasion.